So here we have the standard T5 problem, which is these little things here break off and then the cup holders don't work. And as you can see, this one's actually broken at the bottom. So these little lugs are a bit of a pain. How do we get this out? Well, let's just make things a bit tidier by pushing that out. And now give it a good hard pull to the left. And out it comes. There you go, unit's out. Okay, so now we turn it over and we cut this front panel piece off here. It comes off. Now you can see how this is held in with one clip on this. So you can see it's broken off. So what the uh, solution I've come up with is basically to me, this is just a piece of old welding wire. What I'm going to do is I'm going to sit that over this hole here and then melt it into the actual plastic. Just need to bend the shape a little bit to make it curve around. So there it is bent into the right shape. It's the same methodology as you use for repairing plastic bumpers and stuff. So you just get your soldering iron, take the end out and put a bit of a brass bolt in or a brass nut so the heat will transfer. And then once the soldering iron's up to temperature, hold it on top of this and you slowly melt it into the plastic. It takes about three or four minutes to do it slowly each side. So as you can see, it's starting to melt nicely now into the plastic. Just applying gentle pressure, pushing it down, see? That's it done. Tidy this up afterwards with a little bit of emery. And there we have it, job done. Okay, so I've done both sides now. The bottom ones are still good, so I'm not doing anything with those at the moment. The bottom looks here, these are fine. So I've just done both top ones, tidied them up a little bit with a bit of emery cloth, and now I just need to rebuild it. Okay, so that's the first side back in. All seems to be working fine. Put the other side back on now. Other side's now complete. And all we need to do is engage back in the slots and push it back in. There it is, all finished. Seems to work fine. Job done. So, a quick and easy fix for it. We haven't got to cut wires or do any of the messing around. You can still see the little bits of work I've done, but it's pretty well hidden. I think that'll do fine. Hope you enjoyed the video.